Hello again, this is Delta Climber coming to you from Delta Climber Studios, Roblox, Swordburst 2, and Floor 12. I have bumped into the ancient wooden chest. That is where the most powerful weapon on Swordburst 2 can be obtained. And I have found, I was running along a road and saw damage coming from deep under the ground, under the road. And I knew that there was a place near there that was underground. So I started exploring and bumped into this little hole your character can go through. And lo and behold, the ancient wood chest appears. Kind of like Santa Claus, I guess. So I'm recording down in this little lair. And I'll just record one destruction or one breaking of the ancient wood chest. And I'd love to show you guys where this is. And I'll see about doing that. How to get to the ancient wood chest. The only problem is, I know three people that know about it. That's me and these other two people. Unless that's one person and their alt character. Then that would be two people. But the ancient wood chest is obtainable. It is found. There's also a hidden little wooden chest on floor four around from the crocodiles along the edge of the coast, along the edge of the water. But it does not give you anything like this one does. This one, you can obtain a stick from it. And the stick is a level 350 weapon, supposedly, if not the most powerful, one of the most powerful weapons on the game. And... It takes it a while to respawn. I do not know the respawn time for the ancient wood chest. There it is, right there. The ancient, it says ancient wood chest. Oh, there's three people down here now. I mean, three people other than myself. It, it kind of like the neon chest on floor 11. I know where that one is. I actually got a purple crafter from it. And there it is. And let's go down. Yep, I got 12,000 veil from it. And as you can see, there's four of us down here. Oh, I see what it is. Is three of them were all packed together there. So... I'll probably move my alt character down here and farm on it as well. But anyway, Delta Climber coming to you from Delta Climber Studios, Roblox, Sword Burst 2, and Floor 12, the hidden underground layer of the ancient wood chest. Till next time, play the game, have fun playing the game, play it straight, don't hack. Arrivederci! Hello again, this is Delta Climber coming to you from Delta Climber Studios, Roblox, and Swordburst 2. Oh boy, this is an exciting video for me. We just had an update, and I did a video on where have all the monsters gone. And I couldn't play that old song without getting a, a violation from YouTube. Uh, some of y'all probably don't even know about that old song, where have all the flowers gone. But anyway... They did an update, and they have installed some new legendaries, and they also have been installed a ancient wood box on floor 12. It's very similar to the neon box on floor 11, and now there's also a little wooden box there, a little wooden box on floor 4. So um, I have discovered the location of the ancient wood box on floor 12, and after talking with my advisor here at Delta Climber Studios, which is my wife, my best friend, she says, put the information out there just for your viewers. So 
This is for you guys who had stuck with Delta Climber Studios all this time. Remember this, and just before this video, I put some warnings out. This is a small space that this box, it's a big box, like the neon chest um, that it spawns in. So it will fill up with people. And the higher level people that go down there, it's going to be harder for the lower level people to get credit for the kill of the box. So remember that before you go telling everybody you know uh, the location of the Ancient Wood box. The Ancient Wood box, if I'm not mistaken, spawns one of the largest, most powerful weapons, if not the most powerful weapon on Sword Burst 2, the stick. Yes, that's right. I think it's a long sword or something, but I sure would like to get two of them. Level 350, the stick, it's a tribute weapon, according to Wiki. But Wiki did not know the location. But we are about to show you here at Delta Climber Studios where the Ancient Wood Box is located. So we're starting right here. This is the main portal that you come in. And we're just going to go out and take a right. There's no maze or anything. It's just extremely well hidden and camouflaged. I did a video earlier about this wooden star looking thing or this star looking thing that had four. It's kind of like the Avatar. It looks like earth, wind, fire or whatever and water under the ground. And I did not disclose its location until someone could tell me what it is for. Well, no one has still told me what it is for, but I think I know what it's for now because the new skills with this last update, the new skills are in alignment with each of the four pillars on that, I don't want to call it an altar, but on that crafting table or whatever it may be. So that's one thing that's down here. And there's also a hidden control room or research lab or something down here. And then I was running by, headed to Lemur, and saw damage coming from under the ground. And I immediately knew that it had to be in connection with that place. So here we go. Oh, there's a little chest. And some of y'all saw, saw me and thought I was crazy. Oh, my goodness, look at him. He's, I went along every inch of the edge of the map trying to see if... I actually found a place where you can get off the map, um, where there's a hole where you can get off the map accidentally and fall off out of, out of world. Let me see. Yes, there's only that one ugly, hungry thing following me. Nobody else following why would there be? All right. Let me get rid of old beastie here. Okay. We are right here, Lemur, and then the road turns down. I was fighting the uh, newborn abomination right here at the top one day, and he pushed me over in this hole. This is what you do. You fall over in this hole. Right down there is where the star-shaped four-pillar crafting table thing is. And you turn this way, and I noticed that there was bushes. There's bushes right there. So I went up and I started checking. I went into the water looking, but you go through the bushes, and here is a pathway. If you go there to the left, that is where the research lab is located. But if you go straight through this wall, here, here's Johnny, in case you've never seen the Johnny Carson show anyway. So this is where you will find the ancient wood chest. And once again, let me encourage you before you go telling all of your friends where it's located, you might want to consider it's going to get crowded down here. And the people that have, like we've got maxed out Exodus, that's 325 hitting 31,000. But there are people that will have 350 weapons down here trying to get the stick. And they'll use curse and make it very difficult for you to get your quarter of a million 
hit points in. Also, the more people who know about this, the lower the value of the items you get from it will be. Delta Climber coming to you from Delta Climber Studios, Roblox, Sword Burst 2, Floor 12, and the spawn place of the ancient wood chest. Until next time, play the game, have fun, play it straight, don't hack. Oh, yes. And know that once this information gets to the exploiters, they will turn up their damage so that nobody can get an ancient wood chest. I hope they don't do that because there are people who exploit for different reasons, but there are some that do it for greed, and they'll be the only ones to be able to get whatever's in there. So I'm down here farming it now, and hopefully I'll get something in before the word gets to them. But until next time, Arrivederci! This has been a Delta Glimmer Studio production.